As mentioned in my last video, Sunday Swap is going live on January 20th. High time to take a look at the deck so you can start buying and earning Sunday tokens right when it goes live. What's up? My name is Caroline and this is Wealth in Progress where you'll learn how to make passive income with cryptocurrencies. In this video, I'll show you how to use the Sunday Swap DEX. Now they're going live with a beta DEX version that will allow you to swap ADA for Sunday tokens and also farm different pairs in order to earn even more Sunday tokens. So not only can you earn Sunday tokens by participating in the ISO, I'll leave that video, my past video on top of my head. If you haven't checked that out, do that as well. And now this is the second part that will show Show you how to buy more Sunday token or how to earn it with farming. Now, I've actually been consistently selling my Cardano over the last couple of months to buy back lower and I've just bought back after the announcement at $1.31. While I love Cardano, growing my portfolio is my number one priority and therefore taking profit is essential. Now, if you'd like to see my whole portfolio and all of my trades, plus get weekly deep dive analysis that show you where the markets are likely to move next, then the DeFi Academy is for you. If you'd like to join, go down in the description, click on the first link, type in your email address and you'll receive all the information about how you can join us today. We've also got a detailed exit strategy for our members that help you take profit at the best possible moments. All right, let's dive in. Now, I've taken a look at this article in my past video already about the ISO, so all the information about that is in there. Now, today we'll take a look at the DEX information. So what you'll see in this article is that you'll be able to do yield farming for your rewards that will be available for January through June. That's what we're going to look at and then also swap other tokens for Sunday on Sunday swap and other participating DEXs. So we're not going to look at that today. We're just going to look at Sunday swap. So this is actually a change of plans and they'll explain that later down in the in the article. So we'll get to that in a minute. But that's what you'll be able to do as of January 20th. You'll be able to swap tokens and to farm them for earn, to earn more Sunday tokens. So here they quickly explain the yield farming part. So let's read through that. They say yield farming is a form of staking used by DEXs to reduce the volatility of their liquidity pools. So they'll be distributing 500,000 Sunday each day over the next six months of the DEX operation to yield farmers participating in the following liquidity pools. So only those liquidity pools will give you Sunday rewards. So this is important to note. So you'll have to choose one of those. The most popular will likely be Sunday and ADA, then also LQ ADA, WMT ADA and Cards ADA. So if you stake in one of those pools, you'll receive Sunday rewards. And they also say that this list of eligible pools will be adjusted by community vote later as the ecosystem grows and stable coins launch. So this will not always stay that way. There will be other pools that will distribute Sunday tokens, but for now, this is it. Now, then they mentioned the taste test that they've mentioned earlier. Now, this was their original plan to determine the price. And it's actually an algorithmic program that basically allows the community to determine the price that the Sunday token should have. Now, they mentioned in here that this code has not been part of their audit and that's why they can't go live with that. But the cool thing is that they've replaced that by simply allowing people to swap other tokens for Sunday tokens. So for instance, you can sell your ADA and buy Sunday tokens with that and you don't have to wait for that price determination through the taste test. Now, one last word of warning before we actually dive into the tutorial. Now, they're launching with a beta and that means that not everything will go super smoothly. So they're actually mentioning that in that last part where they say half fast decks. So they, they've got a dedicated article for that, which is this link. By the way, I'll leave this link in the description so you can read through all of that yourself as well. So you can read through the article as well, but what they they actually say is they warn you that the transactions might take a little time in the beginning. So they actually say, as mentioned a week ago, even the most optimistic performance projections show a backlog of orders during the first few weeks of the DEX operation. However, we expect performance to improve as adjustments are made by both the Sunday Swap and Cardano teams. While orders, including swapping, providing liquidity and withdrawing liquidity may take hours to days to process at first, it's important to note that everybody's orders will be processed fairly and in the order they are received and executable. So, of course, this is not great. Orders shouldn't take hours or days, but this is just what happens with new projects, especially when they're in beta launch. It just takes time to even out all the bugs and all the issues. 
Now they have been audited so the code should be fine but it will just take a little time for everything to adjust and to fall into place. So expect some delays and just be a bit patient for everything to run smoothly. All right now let's take a look at the decks. All right so you need to go to sandyswap.finance I'll leave that link in the description as well and then you need to click on enter app. Now this is currently still the testnet because they haven't gone live yet. You'll see that on top here where it says testnet. So I'll just show you what it looks like and all the steps you need in order to be ready but this is not the actual this isn't live yet so this is still the testnet you can totally try that out for yourself and it will go live on January 20th so once you've entered the app you'll get this pop-up and what it says is that you need to download the NAMI browser extension extension and then fund your wallet for the testnet so as of now the SundaySwap only supports the NAMI wallet I'm sure they will add the other normal wallets like Yoroi and Daedalus in the future but as of now I'm not sure if they actually upgrade that for the mainnet so what I recommend is that you download the NAMI extension browser the NAMI browser extension wallet so that you have that ready just in case that the other wallets are not supported yet so we'll do that now quickly so you just have to follow those steps it's really simple and straightforward so let's just do that uh, click on download NAMI browser extension and then click on your uh, preferred browser so I'll choose Chrome for that and it basically works like any other browser extension like MetaMask or Yoro so a pretty simple process okay now next click on add to Chrome then click on add extension. So in order to pin it, you can just click on that puzzle icon and then click the pin button. So it always appears here. All right, now you can click in the, into that wallet icon and now we'll set the, the wallet up. So you could theoretically import another wallet from your Daedalus, but if you click on that, they actually recommend creating a new wallet and then sending funds over. So we'll go with that in order to have the best user experience. So click on new wallet, accept the terms and click on continue. As always, we need to write down the seed phrase in a secure way so that no one sees it. So quickly do that now and then I'll come right back. Okay, once you've written all of that down, you can click that, that icon that you've started, click that checkbox click on next and now you'll need to add those couple of words to make sure for the program to make sure that you've written it down so I'll quickly do that now all right now obviously you shouldn't do it like I'm doing it now so I'm showing you all of the all of my seed phrase and that is because I'll never use this wallet but for you you should make sure that no one sees that but just for this example I filled those words in and now I can click on next now you need to give your account a name and then enter a password and then click on create. All right, so the wallet has been created so we can close that. And then if we go back into the Sunday Swap app, I think we need to uh, reload that and then you can basically do the other steps. So right now it's not connected. So you first need to cl click on, or actually I think you can click on the better guide and we'll walk you through exactly. So click on connect your wallet. Now uh, confirm that this is the testnet and then click on NAMI. So this will open up your wallet and then click on access. Now what it says, so it just flashed a warning that we need to swap the, to the testnet first. So let's do that now. Click on that NAMI icon here then click on your funny profile icon and then go to settings then click on network and you need to to move that toggle to testnet now that's just for now once it goes live on january 20th you'll have to have that on mainnet so if you're using it on the testnet now make sure to then swap it back to mainnet so for this example we use the testnet so now you see down here that's fine okay i'll uh, just refresh the page i'm not sure if that's going to work now again, click on better guide, same, same thing, and now it should work. All right, so that has now connected to my wallet. Then again, click on better guide, and the last step you need to do in order to use the testnet, that's not for the mainnet, but if you wanna try it out already, is that you need to fund your wallet with those testnet tokens. So this is what you'll receive, just click on that. To, so just click to confirm that these are not real assets, that's just to, to, for test purposes. And then click on fund wallet. Now, I've actually already tried that maybe two hours ago and it didn't go through yet. So I'll be patient with my other wallet and I can't show you any of the other processes as of now because this just takes time. But anyway, if you only wanna use the mainnet, then you don't need to do that anyway. So we close that now and I'll see and I'll quickly show you all the other things that you can use on that you can do on the decks. 
So when the beta mainnet of the SundaySwap DEX is going live, then you'll be able to swap tokens and to provide liquidity in order to farm more Sunday token. So let's quickly look at that. First, look at, let's take a look at swap. Now this works basically the exact same way as any other decentralized exchange. So if you've ever, if you've ever used PancakeSwap or anything similar, this will look very familiar. So basically what happens is that you can choose what token you want to sell in order to buy another token, in this example, Sunday token. So most likely you'll want to sell ADA and then in here you'll want to buy Sunday. Now you can type that in and oh, that actually shows up, great. So this is what you'll need to do. And right now, now that I'm opening it again, you can see that you can also buy a bunch of those other testnet tokens. Then you simply need to enter the amount. So for instance, 100 ADA, that gets you a whole lot of Sunday tokens. And now you'll see that I don't have enough of a balance in here, but you would then be able to swap it in here. Now, if you want to farm your tokens in order to earn more Sunday tokens, then you actually always need two tokens. So that's what I've shown you in the article. Let's quickly go back to that. So this is this part. So let's take this, this as an example. So what you need is you need Sunday tokens and ADA tokens, and you need the exact same dollar amount of each. So you need the equal amount. So for instance, if you want to put in $200, then $100 need to be Sunday tokens and $100 need to be ADA tokens. So what you need to do in order to farm is you first need to get those equal amounts of both tokens. So if you have your $200 worth of ADA, then you choose ADA here. Or let's say you've got 200 ADA for simplicity reasons. Then you choose 100 ADA and swap that into into Sunday. So that gets you that amount. Then you've got 100 ADA left and you've got this amount of Sunday, which is equal to 100 ADA. All right, now once you've got both of that, you can click on liquidity. And then with the, both, of those both of those tokens, you need to buy another token, which is called an LP token, and that will then be put in that pool and that will earn you those Sunday rewards. So you need to click on provide liquidity and then, one, and then what you'll do is you choose both of those tokens. So for our example, we have ADA and Sunday. Okay, so that doesn't appear because most likely because I don't have it in my wallet, but that's what you would do. You would choose that. And then same process, so you would choose 100 ADA and that will give you the equal amount of Sunday tokens. And then you'll be able to confirm that and then you'll receive that LP token. Now at the moment, the yield farming option is actually under home. So if we go back to that, then you can search for that pool. So that was um, Sunday. Yeah, perfect. So this is the pool that I've chosen for this example. And then you can click on that drop down. So this actually actually gets you to the same window as what I've shown you with liquidity. So if you click on provide liquidity, then you can choose both those tokens and then click on, it will probably be something like submit or something like that. Now, once this has all gone live, there will probably be also a withdrawal button, something like that here, where you can withdraw or claim your Sunday rewards to then either stake it again, to either farm it again, put it back in the pool or to sell it or keep it or whatever you wanna do with it. So these are basically the, the very, this is a very basic rundown of what you can do once the DEX goes live. It is possible that this will look a bit different, but what you can do is you can already take a look at it now, use the testnet if it works for you, if you can claim those tokens, you might need to be a bit patient. And what is great is if you've already familiarized yourself with the layout and everything, then you'll be much quicker to actually use it when it goes live. So I highly recommend taking a look at it now already so that you're ready on January 20th. All right, so that's it for this video. That's how you can use the DEX and how you can farm to get more Sunday tokens. I'll personally be using the ISO and I'll probably also use the DEX as well, but I'll definitely participate in the ISO. So I've already delegated my Cardano. And if you wanna do that too, don't forget to check out my video, link in the description actually. And while you're down there, don't forget to click on the DeFi Academy link, leave your email address so you, can, so you receive all the information about how you can join the DeFi Academy today. If you like this video, Video, hit the like button down below, share with your friends and be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!